Okay, this is inside the Robert Street property. It is not advertised yet. There is an enclosed porch here. That stove will be removed. Uh, that gives you an opportunity to get out of the weather before coming into the house. Then the house itself is renovated. So these, uh, this is all new flooring, new paint, new light fixtures, uh, updated electrical. He's replaced uh, some water lines, things of that nature. I believe the furnace is new. So this is a luxury vinyl plank flooring. Very sturdy, uh, holds up well against weather. This would be the dining area here. Over here we have the kitchen fully renovated. So that will be the stove. That will be the dishwasher, the refrigerator. There is a lot of cabinet space for a two bedroom place, as well as a nice bar you could use for a breakfast bar. Pass through window to the living room. Uh, down the hall here, start with the master bedroom. This is a pretty large master bedroom. You can see the space between these two outlets is wider than a king size bed, so there's plenty of room. Like if you had a king size bed, your uh, end tables or nightstands would go there where the outlets are at. So you can see it's pretty large. Plenty of room for like a, if you wanted to set up a chest of drawers or something. And I apologize for the noise. The landlord is downstairs doing some work in the basement, so it's kind of noisy. And we have a good, uh, good sized walk-in closet here. Lots of hanging and shelf space. And then a renovated bathroom. This was set up to be wheelchair accessible. So it's got a, a nice walk-in shower. You get a nice wide doorway leading into where the toilet will go. It just needs to be finished up there. And then we have the sink medicine cabinet, lights. Okay, then back out in the hallway, we have a second bathroom. <clears throat> you got washer dryer hookups here. Some storage space up top. We've got the vanity, toilet, and here we have a full bath, tub shower combo. All right, and then here is the second bedroom. My guess is that this is probably about 13 or 14 feet long and about 12 foot wide. Good size uh, closet ceiling fan again. This has uh, two different furnaces. It does not have air conditioning. So something to keep in mind, but Cody's not that hot and single level homes typically don't require it. A uh, window unit is usually sufficient for the little bit of cooling that you need. Okay, and again, this deck will be removed. It's going to be replaced uh, probably with a, a new deck that will include a wheelchair ramp. And then basically the outside is just going to be dirt or gravel. No real yard to speak of, which means your yard maintenance will be low or non-existent. Uh, there is an, a basement apartment. Like I said, the owner's down there working now. Uh, it's occupied by an 80-some-year-old man who's been there forever uh, and should be fairly quiet. I believe he pretty much keeps his lights off and uh, sleeps a lot. So across the way, we have this whole Robert Street. Everything down there is basically a new subdivision. All newer homes in the last 10 or 12 years. We've got a newer storage facility across the way. And then down here is industrial. Over here we've just got more vacant space that the owner may eventually build a triplex uh, or something, maybe some more rentals. And in the back where that uh, truck is parked is where the basement tenant occupies or parks and then goes down into his basement apartment. And there's another uh, structure back there that'll be eventually turned into a one bedroom, one bath. So that is it for Robert Street.